Bitcoin whales accumulate $5.4 billion in July, reaching decade high. Harvey Hunter last updated August 1st, 2024 at 1514 GMT3, two minutes read. Two-way price. Our volatility saw Bitcoin whales accumulate $5.4 billion cillion of BTC in July, capitalizing on market lows in the fastest scoop up in a decade. A large Bitcoin holders or addresses owning at least 0.1% of BTC circulating supply accumulated over 84,000 BTC in July, valued at $5.385 billion cillion per into block and trading view data. The move represented the highest since October 2014 when Bitcoin reached 11 month lows. Similarly, last month's accumulation was driven by bargain hunting during the early July price dip below $55,000 and brief pauses during the recovery to $69,000. This strategic accumulation displays confidence and a strong belief that the prolonged consolidation phase between $50,000 and $70,000 will eventually end with a bullish breakout. Why are Bitcoin whales so confident? This accumulation precedes the anticipation of an upcoming U.S. Federal Reserve interest rate cut. According to CME's FedWatch tool, traders estimate the probability of a September 5.255% ease at 86.5% from its current 5.25%, 5.50%. This follows Federal Reserve Chair Jerome Powell's comments on Wednesday, which indicated a potential rate cut coming as soon as September. Powell emphasized that the economic data needs to back up the potential renewed liquidity easing. The central bank held its benchmark interest rate steady in the 5.25%, 5.50% range, maintaining a status quo as expected. The Fed and Powell's remarks suggested that a September rate cut isn't a done deal yet. Rather, it's just a question of seeing more good data from inflation and labor market softening to point in that direction. The bullish sentiment also stems from renewed capital inflows via stable coins or digital assets with values pegged to external references like the U.S. dollar. As per Interblock data, the total market capitalization of stable coins rose 2.11% to $164 billion in July, the highest since April 2022. This accumulation suggests inflows of new capital into the markets, reflected by the positive price action of digital assets in July. The market is over Mt. Gox. The recent price volatility has been largely fueled by the past German Bitcoin sell-offs and ongoing defunct Japanese exchange Mt. Tuck. Gox Bitcoin transfers to repay creditors. However, Bitcoin's price has remained stable despite Mt. Gox transferring a further $2.5 billion worth of Bitcoin on Wednesday. This transfer reduced Mt. Gox's Bitcoin holdings from $9 billion to $3 billion. Historically, such large transfers often precede price drops. However, it appears traders might not be as worried about potential sell-offs as they have been in recent weeks. Analysts from Arkham Intelligence reported that 33,105 BTC were moved, likely to BitGo for distribution to creditors. While some selling pressure is anticipated due to Bitcoin's long-term price increase, most creditors are expected to be long-term holders. In a report, blockchain analytics firm Glassdoor noted, the profile of the creditors appears to represent one of a hodler or long-term investor, dampening the magnitude of sell-side pressure across the coming weeks. This tendency to hold rather than sell helps maintain market stability and supports Bitcoin's price overall. Bitcoin stability amidst such significant movements suggests a strong market and enduring confidence in its value. This sets an interesting precedent for price action in the coming months, highlighting high potential investment opportunities. Follow us on Google News.